Hey there everyone, it's me, Ash Stone. I'm trying a new camera that is actually going to take sound while I record, which is a first. I've actually I used, bought this video camera back when I was doing the Clueless Girls with Trina so that I could record our videos, Trina's and I's videos, a lot easier. Alright, um, so I told you that I was going to do video blogs more frequently. I was going to do them more often. Um, we all know that I'm having my amazing boyfriend Justin edit my videos now, so I'm not going to have as many pauses, hopefully. Um, I'm also going to try and find better lighting. <laughs> Alright, and since I have this camera now, instead of using, oh wow, the lighting on that's perfect. Instead of using my webcam, I can show you more backgrounds, I can show you more things, I can do more, I can... The possibilities are actually a lot more endless. Anyway, so today's video is going to be about shoes. I love shoes. We all love shoes. Shoes are shoes. <laughs> Alright, so this is um, one of my many collections of shoes. I actually have a double drawer at my mom's house still full of my shoes. Those are mainly dress shoes though, including my Cinderella shoes that I will have to show you sometime. So we're going to show you some shoes. Um, I have what I call my Crayola collection, which um, for those of you who don't know your primary colors, they're red, yellow, and blue. I have my yellow shoes, which I get talked about a lot about at school. Um, I go to an almost all guys school, so yellow shoes kind of stand out. And then I have, I have these red shoes. I also have another pair of darker red burgundy shoes that I only wear when I wear my Twilight stuff. <laughs> um, and these are, these have this fabulous little bow tie thing right here. Um, and then I have my blue Crayola shoes, which are just like my yellow. I got these at Walmart. Um, I'm pretty sure they were five dollars. Then I have I have my hot pink ones my mom got for me at Kmart. They, I don't know if you can tell, they have more lace to them. Actually, the first time I ever wore these was in my photo shoot with Miranda that you might get to see. Um, you might have seen, actually. Um, then there's I got these at Goodwill. Um, I don't know if you can see them. They're gray and pink. I don't think the lighting's right in here. Um, the gray and pink, I call them my girly elephant shoes. Um, they're also flat. I love ballet flats. I have a lot of pairs of black ones. I got these at a yard sale. And then I have, I have these ballet slippers. I got these at Stephen Berry's. Loved Stephen Berry. These are black with a, they have a velvet bow. I don't know if you can see with the lighting. My dog actually chewed a, chewed a hole in the corner of the bow. Um, these are my Pocahontas shoes. They have flip flops, the tassels, and the, I got these from Claire's. I wear a size 10. I have big feet. Um, I'm a tall girl. Everybody says that the Statue of Liberty wasn't built on a small foundation, which is so true. I have these. These are Soho's. I got these at uh, Kmart as well. And they're, I don't know if you can tell, they're polka dotted with little bows. Um, once again, flat shoe. Not a big flip flop fan. And my mom bought these for me to use at my grandparents' house when I got in and out of the pool. Um, they have these, I don't know if you can tell, but those, there's bumps on that. You can see. They're really painful um, until your feet build a tolerance to them. Um, these are my silver slingbacks. This is a slingback for those of you who don't know what a slingback is. I bought these, Value City. If you don't know what a value city is, it's a little like a Burlington Coat Factory. Maybe you have one of those. Um, anyway, I got them on sale and I wore them with a couple different prom dresses, I think. Um, I love these shoes. I don't know if you can see the detail on that. They're little flowers, but it's kind of a mesh. So when you wear them, it looks like you have flower tattoos all over your feet. I don't wear these too often. I think I've never actually worn them out of the house. I also have my Easter shoes. Um, I got these at Goodwill. They actually fit me. Which, if you have a big foot like I do, you're lucky the shoes fit you. Here are some of my black, one of my black pairs. I love these shoes as well. They're very soft, very comfy. I got these, I call these my Beyonce shoes. I don't know, they just make me think of like R&B Diva. Um, they're actually a goldish color. I don't know if you can see the detail. They're, um, they kind of look like alligator. Um, I got these at a Goodwill. I think there's a Goodwill store um, about two hours south of here. Um, the store next door, every time they would get extra stuff, they would just give it to the Goodwill store. 
So they actually came from Target where they were originally $25. I got them for three. Never been worn, still have the ties. <sighs> okay. Um, this is, these I call my hooker heels. Um, I've never worn this particular shoe. Actually, this particular pair of shoes. I don't know where the other one is at the second, actually. I think it's in my other box. Never worn these in public. Um, they have a platform in the top, like your foot rests here. So this is all platform right here. And then um, this is a six inch heel. I don't know if you can tell. Um, and they're zebra stripes, but they have little sequins in there. Um, I've never worn these. They were so cute though, the little peep and pointed tail. Um, as you can tell, I don't like peep toe shoes. Um, they just, they take so much effort to try and, and wear because you know,